Today is the last day of week four of the 555 challenge. You've done exercises and stayed active and stayed consistent for one whole month. I am so proud of you and I can't wait to see you finish it off. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button and that notification bell so that every time I post a video such as this, especially for my 555 challenge, you will be notified. Also, if you like these kinds of videos, why don't you smack that like button? It will definitely help support my channel. Today's 555 challenge, you'll be doing a cardio workout, but guess what? It is low impact, but it will still keep your heart rate going. There's no equipment needed only your body weight before the workout shout out to six figure games thanks so much for supporting my channel with your comments make sure that you warm up before any workout i'll put a link below for warm-up videos for this workout you've got 45 seconds work and 10 seconds rest the first exercise are cut jacks Champ up next is left knee drive. Keep your right knee bent and see how low you can go as well as engage your core throughout the exercise. Well then champ, what you do on one side, let's do on the other side. Next, you have got traveling oblique crunches where you travel to the left, oblique crunch, back to center, and you travel to the right, oblique crunch. But not the least is inchworm, shoulder taps, then knee to elbow.
Well done, Chad. You did a fabulous job. Now it's time for you to rest for 60 seconds before your next round. So grab some water and wipe off that sweat. The first exercise of cut jacks. Well done champ, up next is left knee drive. Keep your right knee bent and see how low you can go as well as engage your core throughout the exercise. Well done champ, what you do on one side, let's do on the other side. Next, you have got traveling oblique crunches where you travel to the left, oblique crunch, back to center, and travel to the right, oblique crunch. But not the least is interim shoulder tops then knee to elbow.
Well done, champ. You did a fabulous job. Now it's time for you to rest for 60 seconds before your next round. So grab some water and wipe off that sweat. The first exercise of clap jacks. Well then champ, up next is left knee drive. Keep your right knee bent and see how low you can go as well as engage your core throughout the exercise. Well then champ, what you do on one side, let's do on the other side. Next, you have got traveling oblique crunches where you travel to the left, oblique crunch, back, center, and travel to the right, oblique crunch. But not the least is inchworm, shoulder taps, then knee to elbow.
well done champ you did a fabulous job now it's time for you to rest for 60 seconds before your next round so grab some water and wipe off that sweat. First exercise of cut jacks. champ up next is left knee drive keep your right knee bent and see how low you can go as well as engage your core throughout the exercise Well then champ, what you do on one side, let's do on the other side. Next, you have got traveling oblique crunches where you travel to the left, oblique crunch, back to center, and you travel to the right, oblique crunch. But not the least is inchworm, shoulder taps, then knee to elbow.
well done champ you did a fabulous job now it's time for you to rest for 60 seconds before your next round so grab some water and wipe off that sweat. <laughs> The first exercise of crab jacks. Well done champ, up next is left knee drive. Keep your right knee bent and see how low you can go as well as engage your core throughout the exercise. Well done champ, what you do on one side, let's do on the other side. Next, you have got traveling oblique crunches where you travel to the left, oblique crunch, back to center, and travel to the right, oblique crunch. But not the least is inchworm, shoulder taps, then knee to elbow.
Well done, champ. You have completed your workout. Now it's time to stretch those hardworking muscles so that you can recover quickly, ready for tomorrow's workout. I hope you enjoyed your workout and you are getting used to staying active and committing to doing workouts for five days in a week, as well as you're staying consistent with all your other goals for this year. Enjoy the rest of your day and I'll see you soon.